Hello and welcome my digital nomads. And in today's video, I'm going to be reviewing a AI content rewriter that is specifically designed to pass AI content detection tools. All right. So, uh, they make really bold claims with this AI content, um, read writer. And they, they say that their tests have proven again and again, consistently that they have been able to rewrite any AI content and make it pass any kind of, uh, AI content checker and I'm not sure. So I'm going to go ahead and check it out. The AI content checker that I'm going to be using is originally originality.ai. And for those of you who are wondering why do you want, you want to make sure that your AI content is written so that it passed AI detection tools is because if it is detected as an AI, um, you know, AI written tool, uh, content, it won't rank as high. Okay. So that's why you want to, you know, make, make sure you take the extra steps to do that and don't be lazy with that. All right. So this is, in my opinion, this is probably the best AI content detection tool. It's a paid tool. I have another video that goes over this and I'll leave a link down in the description below if you want to check it out. But this is the tool I'm going to be using to gauge this tool here. It's word AI. And it basically says it can, you know, uh, take any AI content and, rewrite it so that it completely passes uh, AI content detection tool, right? Avoids AI content detection. And then it has all of these other features here. And then this is the pricing. But first of all, I, I want to go ahead and see if this is worth it because if this doesn't work like it claims to, then it's, it's just not worth the money. All right. So when you log in here, um, this is what you're going to see in the dashboard in Word AI. On the left hand side, you got rewrite articles, avoid AI detection, uh, saved articles, bulk rewrite, API, rewriting sentences, usage info, affiliate, and so on and so forth. What we're just basically going to cover is this one here. Right? And I, I basically um, put my own resources to make sure that, you know, uh, you don't have to go ahead and waste money so or your time. So if you like this video and you find it helpful, please hit the like button. All right. So basically, I'm going to go to take me to avoid AI detection. Click on that. And then I want to paste the AI detection tool here. Now, the third part is I'm going to use an AI content writing tool that I like. It's a uh, it's basically has a lifetime deal. And it, it the user face is easier to use than other ones. All right. And that's word hero. Let me go ahead and enter my details real quick. Okay. So when you go inside, this is what it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, Hmm. Maybe I'll go with a blog paragraph, something very simple. And then I'll just write a short description. Um, let's see. What is meditation? A okay, very simple. Just leave the keyword blank tone, maybe excited and click right for me. And then the content will be generated on the right hand side. Uh, this is a web based tool. So, you know, you don't have to have a high end computer to run this, uh, AI content generation tool. Okay. And here it is. It has meditation is an ancient practice that has been gaining popularity in recent years for a good reason. All right. You can read the rest of it yourself. You can pause it and read the rest of yourself. I'm going to go ahead and copy it. And then first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to check the control, check the baseline. So I'm going to go to originality.ai. I'm going to scan this, uh, this basically what is meditation and then word hero. Okay. I'm going to click on scan now. Uh, I don't need, I don't need to check for plagiarism. So I uncheck this so it doesn't take extra credits. I just want to detect AI. Okay. I'm going to go scan now. I'm going to let it do its thing. And guess what? It's a hundred percent AI. So that's the baseline. 100% AI. This, that means this originality AI is working. All right. Now let's see if the second part, this word AI actually does its job like, like claims to, I'm going to click on control V. Uh, I'm going to increase this to change more. Maybe, uh, let's see. Yeah. Just, just to change more. And then I'm going to 
click on avoid AI detection. Let it do its magic. All right. Let's see if the claim of it can you can basically rewrite your AI written content and make it you know human sounding and pass AI content detection tool. Let, let's see what it sounds like. So meditation has grown increasingly popular over, over time for good reason. Modern life can be stressful, so meditation provides a useful means of managing this stress while offering many other advantages. Here we will examine exactly what meditation entails as a practice and its history as well as its workings. This article covers it all. All right, and then you can read the rest. No, it, it's readable. That's what I want to check for, check for because if it makes this pass AI detecting detection tools, but it's unreadable, then there's no point as well. All right. So from what I can tell, I'm not an English major. It, it definitely sounds readable to me. I'm gonna go ahead and copy this. All right, and let's see the results. Uh, nope. Okay. So I'm gonna start a new scan. Yep, start a new scan. I'm going to go with uh, what is meditation. And then it's uh, Word AI. Paste it in here. Yep. That's weird. Copy. And then paste in here and then scan now now if you remember the first one was 100% AI let's see if this one oh it's only 3% original 97% AI so <laughs> so basically this hasn't really changed at all, all right, and let me see if I can rewrite it again let's see maybe if it, it was just a bad <laughs> I bet, you know, maybe just a fluke output or something. Let, let's try. Let's try it one more time. Control C or copy, and then go to Word AI. Sorry, originality. I'm gonna go with scan again. Oops, sorry. Paste this content. Let's see if it's changed anything. Okay, yeah, it's still 3% origin, original, 97% AI. Uh, maybe I'll try some different topic, different question, and see. You know, maybe this was just a bad topic. You know, I want to give it a fair chance. Um, what? What are the reasons, what are good reasons to get a dot? Okay, I'm gonna click right for me. Let it do its thing, let it run. And once it's finished, I'm gonna go ahead and copy this. Okay, paste it. Paste it into here so that we can get a, um, a baseline. Okay. okay, so that's that. I'm going to click on scan now. And mind you, I do short um, text snippets because if it can't pass you know the short one the short short articles or short text are easy to um, get a higher score and if we can't even get a higher score on that then or if we can't even rewrite a small text to past uh, any kind of content then there's no point point in getting a bigger one all right big uh, more content all right so um, it's a hundred percent AI I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go to avoid detection here I'm going to go to max and then I'm going to go ahead and uh, click on avoid AI detection and then see, you know, see what pops up as a result. All right. 
Now, a quick read. It says, are you pondering adopting a dog but uncertain if it is the right decision for you? Well, let me assure you, there are so many compelling arguments or having a furry companion could be one of the greatest decisions of your life. Uh, it's a bit, kind of a bit weird here, pondering, but I don't know. It's readable. All right, so let's see. Let's see what originality oops, dot AI comes up with. I'm going to put a new scan in here. get a dog and then this is a rewrite by word AI and I'm gonna paste it in here okay scan now and let's see does it maybe a different topic okay so this one comes up with 90% original 10% AI so maybe maybe it depends on you know the uh, the topic but this one actually it, it it comes up as original. So uh, let me try one more. Let me let me just you know triple check. There maybe third time to charm. So I'm gonna go with uh, let's see uh, benefits of intermittent fasting. All right, and then just keep it like that. Okay, so let's see what comes up. And this is what comes up. I'm going to go ahead and take this. It says intermittent fasting is one of the most popular health and fitness trends in recent years. And for good reason, this approach to eating has a wide range of benefits. All right, so let me go on and let me uh, start a new scan. Okay, so this is my original from Word Hero. Gonna scan it to get a baseline, and I'm using my you know paid account. All right, so this is you know my my resources to make sure that you you know you can you can see the real time. There's no funny business here, all right? I'm, uh, original, sorry, original zero percent, one hundred percent AI. Okay, so that's what I expected. Let me go ahead and. Uh, Go to avoid AI detection, start something new, paste it in here. I'm going to go with the most change, avoid AI detection, let it do its thing. So if, if it does this one well, then I, I can say it's safe to assume that it, it does all the other ones well. And the first one was just a, you know, a bad, uh, Bad luck. So it says intermittent fasting has quickly become one of the top health and fitness trends over recent years. And for good reason, this approach to eating offers numerous health advantages that may help you reach your weight loss goals more easily. And then you can read the rest yourself. I'm going to just copy this and let's see. So, so far it's one for one. Uh, let's go with start new scan. Okay. Paste in here and scan now. Hmm. That's kind of weird. Did it, was it able? Let me just make sure I got the right one. Try it one more time. Yeah, so 95% AI, 5% original. Um, yeah, that all I can say is that does this, does, when it comes down to <clears throat> word AI, does it work? You know, the answer is yes, but does it work consistently? No, right? Uh, I've, I've tried three different topics. I, you know, put it into originality.ai and, you know, two, two of the, the three, 
has gotten a score of 5% to 10% original and the rest is AI. Only one has gotten high original score. And <clears throat> all I can say is that if you're going to use word AI, uh, you should use it with a grain, you know, kind of a grain of salt. You should be careful with um, how, you know, like how well this tool claims uh, to be working because as you can see through my, my you know, unscientific test, me just putting three different topics into originality, te uh, testing for the baseline, and then rewriting it through Word AI and then putting it back in and retesting. Uh, it hasn't hasn't done, you know, as well as I would expect if I'm going to, you know, using a paid tool, I would expect it to work 90% of the time. So uh, in conclusion, you know, should you get Word AI? Uh, <clears throat> not at this point, not until they improve the rewritten feature so that it, it can pass originality.ai uh, consistently. Okay. Uh, I don't want to, you know, I, I don't want you to, to, I want you to manage your expectations and I, I don't want you to be disappointed when you, if you ever got word AI and you wonder why isn't it being able to pass the uh, originality.ai sc uh, score or uh, pass a detector. And, and this is what I'm showing you right now. Now, if later on things change, you know, then, I might do another test, but as of right now, I can't recommend Word AI. All right, so I hope this video was helpful, and if it was, could you please hit the like button? Thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.